This thing top speed 30? I believe it's correct. It's way faster than my brother. It's faster than me. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we got ourselves the new remote control RC car. This car is supposed to go almost 30 miles per hour. Um, we're gonna test that out. We're gonna unpackage it here, gonna put it together, we're gonna have some fun today. And uh, well, I'll, redo, I'll do the, uh, the full review at the end, so if you wanna skip ahead, you can. But um, without further ado, let's unbox it here and uh, put it together. Right off the bat, um, the box is actually pretty small. It's actually surprisingly lighter than I thought, but you need a light vehicle if you wanna go fast. So it actually comes with some customizable stickers that you can uh, load the car up with. It's actually pretty light right off the bat. And actually has tiny little clamps on to make it easy to, you know, take the hood off to get to the battery pack and to the motor if necessary. For an outdoorsy type of vehicle, the suspension is... Eh, it's, it's there, it's just... I mean, you can really move it. Um, spongy, but plenty of grip. Uh, four wheels, so if I rotate the back tires, the front tires should move. See, look at that, it's moving. Same thing back here. See, so it's all connected. These little clips here help provide the hood, uh, make sure that the hood is intact. Um, otherwise, if these clamps aren't here, counting all four of these clamps, the hood will just fall right off. Oh, and look at that. There we got it for yourself. The already the battery packed. Looks like it's already Velcroed in. We already have everything we need already in here. Um, the battery's already in here. We have a little sticker on here st saying, um, hazard, do not touch the motor until it has cooled down. So that just shows you that when this thing's running, the motor here, it's gonna get pretty hot. So, um, Let's hook things up here. Oh, by the way, the suspension on these are fantastic. Um, very springy. So we are gonna put this together here and see how fast it goes. You know, I was afraid that this wouldn't come with a charger. I've looked it up, I saw um, other videos of other people talking, and I didn't see a charger on their video. I can confirm what, with this, it does come with a charger, USB port. Um, so that's definitely useful, especially if you have a lithium ion battery. You need to charge that, otherwise, uh, you know, you can't really play it if it's uh, no battery. It's actually two double A's. I just packed them in there should run, um, hang on a second. So there's a button inside the RC control that you have to make sure once you plug in the battery to hold that button for five seconds and then the car will light up. I'm trying to connect to the remote here, make sure that the remote is on, it should sync. Now, I should be able to, you know, use it. So let's see how fast this sucker goes. Let's go. Holy cow. They weren't kidding, this thing is fast. You gotta be careful with your control here. You switch it to slow here, so. There is no, yes, we were scared, hold on. Okay, so it's race time. It's time to see how fast this sucker really is. And after we do that, my brother's going to join the match and he's going to try to race it. So uh, we'll see how fast it is compared to uh, a normal human would run. 
versus how fast it is just on its own. So uh, let's do this. Okay, this is on its own. This is full speed, whoa. Okay. Full speed back. And it has its own little braking powers too, so. Okay, that was on its own. Three, two, one, book it. That's why I can't, my eyesight's off. Okay, Colin, look it. This, <laughs> this thing is clearly faster. Woo! Go. That's, that's not even full speed. I kind of lose control after a bit, but uh, yeah, it's fast. And I'm gonna join in too, just for the fun. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, this thing is a beast. Um, <laughs> stay subscribed. More vlogs coming. No, I get a head start. Back up. Okay. What the? Oh!